Hi, this is William Campbell from Fitzgerald Campbell. This morning we are at the Stanley Moss Courthouse. Uh, that's the courthouse in downtown Los Angeles. Uh, appearing on two cases. One was a case management conference. Uh, at the trial, at, at the hearing, we uh, set uh, trial dates. The other was to oppose a motion for summary judgment. Uh, a motion for summary judgment is one of the many reasons why, if you are sued, you need to retain counsel. Uh, essentially, what a motion for summary judgment is looking for is whether or not there are any tribal issues of material facts. If there are no tribal issues of material facts, then the court will grant the summary judgment motion and there will then be a judgment against the losing party. Um, in this case, uh, we had a motion for summary judgment filed. We opposed the motion. The motion is now under consideration by the court. But if you do not retain counsel, and uh, after being sued and the plaintiff files a motion for summary judgment, it's very likely that you're gonna lose that motion and a judgment will then be entered against you. So look, this is one of the many reasons why you need to retain counsel if you are sued. So summary judgment motions are very complicated motions and you need uh, counsel to be able to properly oppose uh, any, any party that's bringing a motion for summary judgment against you. Uh, but today was a good day for Fitzgerald Campbell and good day for our